Warrantless arrests are justified only if officers have probable cause. In District of Columbia v. Westby, the Supreme Court considered what factors establish probable cause to arrest a group of partygoers for unlawful entry. District of Columbia police officers investigated reports of a party in a vacant house just after 1 a.m. At the scene, officers smelled marijuana and discovered the nearly empty house littered with beer bottles. There were no moving boxes, clothes in the closets, or personal possessions indicating anyone resided there. The living room was being used as a strip club, and officers found several men and a naked woman upstairs. Several attendees ran or hid when the officers arrived. The officers questioned everyone in the house about the party's host, but received inconsistent and evasive answers. Two individuals claimed a woman named Peaches invited them. Peaches wasn't present, so the officers called her. Peaches was evasive and nervous and claimed to be renting the house, but the owner confirmed he hadn't given anyone permission to throw a party or use the house. The officers arrested the attendees, including Theodore Wesby, for unlawful entry. Wesby and several attendees filed a civil suit against the officers and the District of Columbia, alleging false arrest. The district court held that the officers didn't have probable cause for the arrests and weren't entitled to qualified immunity. On appeal, the D.C. Circuit affirmed. The Supreme Court granted cert.